Mm -hmm. This doesn't look so bad. What was all that talk about the spirit gate and misfortune? Hey, this place looks familiar. Yeah, that's it. It looks just like Kamiki village. Kamiki? You mean that tiny village in Shinsu field? That's where the whole legend of Orochi began. I have never crossed the sea and set foot on Nippon before. The divine guidance of Ketoni must have led me here. The monsters of this land shall now taste its cold steel. No, Oki, wait! What about Lika? He's gone. Oh, uh, well. Anyway, this really is Kamiki Village, isn't it? But I'm getting a different vibe from here. Hmm? That's strange. Why is there a full moon again already? Hey, isn't there where, where Asakya's tree was? What's this dinky little seedling doing here? Hmm? Wait a second, you're some kind of god, aren't you? I'm a wood sprite. They call me Sakuya. So cute! Shaku, I hope she even names herself. What did she say her name was? Is Shakuya? Sounds kind of familiar. Anyway, where the heck is Sakuya's tree? Shakuya? That's me! Yeah, yeah, we know already, kiddo. We grown ups are busy right now. Why don't you go off and play? Excuse me, God. Are you looking for me? Did you say God? Hmm, I guess the innocent eyes of a child can see the truth, Ami. Ama? Ama, Mr. Bug, and me, Shakuya. Let's be friends, okay? Mr. Bug? Better watch it, kiddo. <laughs> That's pretty cute. But I thought that wood sprites wouldn't actually age. Maybe they do. Uh oh, well. Yeah, so. Oh, there's a golden gate. That does not bode well. That does not bode well at all. It usually is some kind of precursor to something bad going to happen. So you need to have your progress saved. Or something. I don't know. Ah, it's actually kind of a bit kind of hard to see on the TV, but I think yeah. I can kind of make out the outlines of the trees. Yeah. I pray for your swift growth, Konohana. Rum, 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 rum. Hmm. What do you want with us? Hey, Grams. Still tearing up the dance floor, I see. So what happened to the sacred tree? It got so small all of a sudden. Someone put a curse on it or what? What are you talking about, you fool? I am lovingly raising this seedling to bring peace to the land. It shall drive away Orochi and all of his minions. Orochi? <laughs> Where the heck have you been, Gramps? That sneaky snake's pushing up daisies right about now. I don't have time for your this nonsense, you fool. Year after year you come to our village to claim the sacrifice. And this time you've even learned to speak. Well, today is the day I say enough is enough. Hiya, karate shop. Or punch. 
whatever. Oh man, look at all the trees. I have some work to do. Excuse me, ma'am, but you have some treasure lying in your backyard. Or why did you... yeah. Hmm. You don't fool me, you dumb wolf. Pretending to come sniffing out a sacrifice for Orochi. While all the time you're just waiting to dig up my field. Huh? Give me a break, lady. I've got too much on my mind as it is. Oh, she's angry. Okay, there might be... You might be able to do the minigame again. But I'm not gonna do it. I got too much on my mind as it is. Hey, yeah, sweetie. How you doing? I hope you can cut that Susanna some slack. He's so shy that... What was that all about? No one home? Okay. Or nobody's home. That's how you say it. Hmm. Hey, you're Shiranui. We don't need any of Orochi's familiars around here. Shiranui? Orochi's familiar? Does that have something to do with our slaying Orochi? <laughs> well, you're gonna have to wait in line for an autograph. Shut up. The only one who's gonna get slain is you, you monster. Monster? What's gotten into you, Mushi? Tonight is the night of the full moon. That sad day is once again upon us. This year, the lovely young Nami will be Orochi's next victim. Lovely young Nami? Wow, she sounds hot. Where is she at? Hmm. Oh my, is that Sh Sh Shiranui? Please, I'm begging you. Have mercy on me. I'll make you some yummy sherry cakes. Wow, that sounds pretty tasty, actually. <clears throat> Yeah, so I think you guys can figure out what's going on. It's pretty obvious from the moment that when you talk to Shakuya, well, what's actually going on. But as always, Isun is pretty slow to figure things out. So we'll just have to have patience and wait for him to realize what's going on. Well, you know what they say. Heroes are not necessarily smart. Ha! Oh, I punted that right into the sea, or right into the water. I am the greatest! <laughs> Pops hasn't changed a bit. Oh, Nami, let's... Nami? Don't tell me this bonehead's cheating on Kushi. What the... Huh? Ah, I slept like a log. I must have dozed off while training to defeat that no-good Shiranui. Hmm. Who are you? What do you want with me? 
I'm Nagi, the greatest warrior ever. Wait a minute. J your Shiranui? You still dreaming or something, Pops? I mean, greatest warrior ever. Give me a break. You brought along a little peaside monster this time. Well, I have you now, Shiranui, you monster. Monster? Come on, Pops. Wake up. You must still be dreaming. And what's with this Shiranui business? You're still obsessed with the past? Past? Stop speaking nonsense. Look at that moon. Tonight is the night when the moon waxes to its fullest. It marks the day when Orochi shall claim his human s sacrifice. Orochi? Wait a second. What the heck's going on? This sinister air. That jerk Orochi must be stirring. How is that possible? <laughs> Too late to feign innocent Shiranui. We know you come each year to size up Orochi's human sacrifice. But this time things are going to be different. I, Nagi, shall put an end to your devilish work. Orochi? Nagi? No, it can't be. Right, Ami? I mean... The Spirit Gate couldn't have possibly sent us back to... Kamiki Village 100 years in the past, could it? 